abantu ate no kusingira dalu bwagazi bw'abantu okuvayo kutande kokola ne basoko kusa ebali ebyo bofuzi mabyo bofuzi bitagude tagude abavubuka mu nsangi zo nambe tudu byone byegwanga ocho abavubuka bo mulango region bo bagambye nti bagala kokola ero lwalero tuvude nge chongole ate la tuvudeyo okufuna mukago ne private sector foundation atukira kutandika ga abili mu satu mwezi guno okulaba nti no youth cooperative eyalango ebera nge tandika ka wefu be ochiwani ko chetu wado kufuna ensimbi sente zigenda okuyamba bavuka okufuna obumu obutono okufuna amagezi ke bayinzo okukozesa okweyimiriza awo eranga baga bensimbi bila dala ku mitwali etano ja dola era twagala tubayambe ko okulaba nti ensimbi zino zifune ba atano oluvanyuma twetu omukulembeze we gwanga alabe abavuka abana abakozi kuna ne bitundu bisingo obunji nibade mu okwe mu bunyanti abakulembeze ba districts abadde bakosa bubi sente za bavuka abamu ngabaze ko Chicho la vie pour la vue kavawa. Ce jour-là, pour bien nous voir tous ensemble. A ma vue ka ben sans ce match tout le chino. Bala bicatu ba malidi vu. Okuno nia emi kutu emi dala. Oksinga kwejo ejwe de dry government. Nenga chwe basa government lokwante emi kutu ya tichadewo. Ensi mbiza ma vue ka mbi district ensinga zibuza buze dwa ba ba abaziga ba abasimba yowansi na dalaba community development officers abatambuza ba na ba vuka ni ba bagamba te wali form gain that da yoko ma wo aine we sanga tiba ba descent into no since that person tiba ba wandika ku papla aine ba ba banja guliyo muendo omneni ba no abala ngoba pude yo government fetu ine chibina chuna bi tuaga lokola tuguli la makubo tulabenti nukusobo loku kazi ya kuonza wa yafi. Nena baba deba pensi mbiza wabuka ya tuja. Nena kaliso niso wa government ya tanzo kuno nyeleza na dala kumbaga division. Nebi tunbe bilala umoli awa kungu abezi bike nsi mbiza wabuka. Yeah, in terms of how you've seen the youth in Laos and Brazil struggling to make a living through the government programs and on their own initiative, what have you got to learn from them? Certainly, I'm, I'm humbled and privileged to be here. I'm not surprised, though, because I've read a lot and, and happened to research a lot about the Lango region. I know who they are. I know their hearts. They are so faithful and committed. So all I came to, to do is to prove what I've been hearing for the past generations. Mm -hmm. And I have no reservations to believe that the program I've come with, which is under a partnership with private sector foundation, to ensure that we secure immediate funding <coughs> for the youth in Lango region who have convened together in their um, umbrella body called the, the, the Lango Youth Cooperative Union can, can kickstart uh, micro scale programs to help them earn a living, to be able to survive, to be able to, to transport themselves, heal themselves when they are sick, marry if they want to. So that's the reason I'm here and I'll not leave until that is achieved. Honorable, other districts will be nearly complain of corruption. District leaders embezzling youth livelihood money grants, and the youth end up really just being used, but they have not got the money. What have the youth of Lamo shown you as far as corruption is concerned? As a leader, as the youth leader in the country, I know pretty much that someone is innocent until proved guilty. I have already handed over the names of the purported guilty people who have been reported to me by my young people all over the region that they are being made to move and walk long distances in search of even mere forms to apply to these funds. And further still, they, they tell them and they give them half the money, quarter the money, and they claim that they are still keeping their money in the banks beyond one accounting year to another. So let this be a wake-up call that I've handed over people to the IGG's office and I'm on the ground, I'm coming. For those of you who know that you have embezzled the youth money, please go and return it or else you will have to face it.